question number five. A 200 kg mass is dropped onto a collar at lower end of a vertical bar 3 meter long and 28 mm in diameter. Full stop. Calculate the height of drop if the maximum instantaneous stress is not to exceed 120 Newton per mm square. What is the corresponding instantaneous elongation? Take capital E is equal to 2 into 10 raised to 5 Newton per mm square. Now this is the question which we have. Let us write the data for this. Here it is given that calculate the height of drop. So from this we can understand that the problem is on impact loading. So the type of the problem is impact loading. I will draw the diagram here. Here it is given a 200 kg mass that is the mass which is attached here. It is 200 kg. So I will convert it into weight that is W is equal to M into G. So it is 200 into 9.81. Therefore, weight will be 1962 Newton. Next, it is attached to a lower end of a vertical bar 3 meter long. Three meter is the length of the bar and 28 mm in diameter. So the diameter of the rod is 28 mm. So from this we, we would be getting the area of the rod. Capital A is equal to pi by 4 into 28 square. That gives me area. 615.75 mm square. Next, here the question is we have to calculate the height of drop. That is this height from the weight up to the collar is what we have to calculate. This is the question for us. So now let us try to solve this problem. I'll write the solution for this. Since for impact loading, stress is given by sigma is equal to P upon A plus under root of P upon A whole square plus 2 EPH upon area into length that is volume. Now here the question is we have to calculate this height. So for calculating this height I would be shifting all terms onto the other side and first what I will do I will try to remove this square root sign. So here I can write this as stress is given to me that is 120 Newton per mm square sigma value. So therefore sigma is equal to 120. Here it is P upon A which is plus. So what I would be doing I will be sending that is P the load is 1962 upon area which is 615.72 or 75 plus the square root of P upon A upon 615.75 whole square plus 2 into E the value is 2 into 10 raised to 5 
multiplied by P which is the load 1962 into H divided by area which is 615.75 into length of the rod is 3 meters that is 3000 mm so if I calculate this I would be getting and shifting the square root sign it is 116.81 whole square which is equal to 10.15 plus 4 24.85 h now i would be shifting the terms and finally h answer comes out to be 32 meters it is 32 meters next they are saying us to calculate the deflection also so i'll say that therefore deflection is given by stress into l upon e so that is stress the instantaneous stress is given as in the question it is 120 length is 3000 young's modulus is 200 or you can say 2 into 10 is to 5 so from this the instantaneous deflection is 1.8 mm our second answer so as we can see here the question was to calculate the height of the load which is falling and the instantaneous deflection and we have calculated both the values with this the question is completed